and what you're seeing is you're seeing the national. So the nationals have usually been ha, has they're usually centered around pitching. They're usually centered around, like I said, Matt Scherzer. And they're usually centered around Steven Strasburg. That was their calling card. In fact, pitching was really big in the World Series. And, of course, you had Anthony Randone. You know, you had some big players. Um, but what you're starting to see is kind of like what the Padres are doing with uh, Tatis, kind of like what the Angels are doing with Matt uh, – what's his name? With uh, Otani, kind of like what uh, – the the Rays are doing no not to, uh, the Blue Jays are doing with Vladimir. There's there's the Nationals are pretty much trying to build around their young star, which is Juan Soto. Matt Scherzer is is pretty much towards the end of his. I'm not gonna say career, but I'm gonna say prime. He's you know he's dealt with some injuries. He he, he doesn't have the same velocity on the ball that he had, of course, when he was. At Matt Scherzer, and I'm not I'm not discrediting Matt. Do not get me confused. Matt Scherzer is still a Hall of Famer. He's still the greatest pitcher Washington Nationals have ever had. Uh, Trey Turner, he's dealt with some injury, and he but and he's an incredible shortstop. But Trey Turner, while he was big for the for the World Series run, you know he's been he's been nicked with some injuries and everything, and the prospects that they're getting, they're leaving a lot of money off. You know a lot of money. Is leaving with a uh, Matt Scherzer, with a Trey Turner, with a uh, John Lester, with a Kyle Schwarber, with a uh, Daniel Hudson, and of course they are. There again, it's I'm not going to say a full rebuild because you have incredible, you have really good players. It's like they're trying to move. They're punting on 2021. They know 2021 is not the year for Washington to make any type of run. So wait to see what happens 2022, 2023, 2024. 